left is the captain of Huancayo, Ricardo Salcedo. On the right is the captain of Nacional, Claudio Nunez. And we go all the pre-match protocol out the way with the coin toss. Participating in the Sul Americana. La otra mitad, the other half of the Eternal Glory. We are underway here at the Estadio Defensores del Chaco as Nacional. They are the home side in the white, predominantly white kids with the red and blue under manager Pedro Sarabia. Excuse me, George. They began the same way the last week a long ball to the right that Feliciano Brizuela could not bring down. Trying to see. It's great to have those boom mics on the sideline. Here's left footed in swinger. Oh, cleared off the line. And what could have been an own goal. Coming over from Cesar Vallejo. Ooh, Valoyes. Seen a lot of that, George. There we go. And now that provides the transition opportunity. Ocampos. Um, pretty much gets in the way of the run there by Yuya. It was now, a screen. A screen. And now a chance for Nacional inside. Brizuela, Brizuela! Oh, off the post! Ocampos was there and off the underside of the crossbar. More discussions on what to do here. And it looks like yeah, Mian is going to be the only one standing. Mian! Golazo! Donald Mian! A brilliant free kick in the rain. And Juan Cayo have the 1 0 advantage and lead 3 1 on aggregate. Exquisite free kick by Mian. Not a long run at all. But he bends it over the wall with his right foot. Five men wall. Oh. Espinola does his best. Couple steps before he launches, but it's too late. With his left hand, touches the ball, probably was already in. And Wankayo get the first. But still, there's a long way to go, remember. Spawn, how will the home side in white respond? This one down the right side. Oh, well done by Brizuela. Lifted inside the header! Goes wide. It was Candia that was able to get his... The Nacional, uh, Millan's a free kick in the 39th minute, the difference so far. Stay with us. The Express Halftime Show brought to you by Verizon Wireless comes your way after this short commercial break. And we are underway the second half here at the Estadio Defensores del Chaco. Club Nacional de Asuncion, they are the home side in the white kits. And they will be attacking from left to right. Sport, Club Sport Juan Cayo, the Peruvian visitors in the red. Kits with the... Now a chance, driving at the defense. Played out wide for Brizuela. Brizuela lifting it in and... Samudio. A chance through the midfield there for Santa Cruz. Oh, great ball with the outside of the right foot. Now an opportunity for Matias Martinez inside the air. Martinez, Martinez! Denied by Samudio. Maybe he was pulled at the very end there. Let's see if VAR gives it a look. It doesn't get better than that as far as chances for this result. Move on to the second phase of the Copa Conmebol Libertadores. Left footed out swinger. It's going to fall for Alfaro. Another header goal! Cristiano Campos in the right place at the right time. And Nacional pull one back. 1-1. One, 3-2 one. on the aggregate in, aggregate in favor of Juan Cayo. But El Club Nacional have hope. How many chances are you going to get to clear the ball without taking advantage of any? Initially, nobody to clear there. And the mistake on the second post Watch here the lower part of your screen. A miss hit by Zalazar. Alfaro able to send it across the goal one more time. 
And the diving header by Ocampos' his third goal this season in all competitions. Zamudio comes across, but a killer of a header from that distance. And Nacional is back in it. No offside there. And I don't see any offside in the second play either when the yeah. ball was played. Yeah. Ocampos is on, onside. It's Fleitas. That's the player that is in question. And you can see with the lines there that that David Fleitas is the player that they are analyzing here. And I, I don't see how this could be nullified. nullified here. Because Fleitas, yep, and they're going to credit I know historically they have played after two legs. If it's level, they'll play a third match mm -hmm. in, in some tournaments. They've done that. Oh, this is a chance. The shot just sails over the crossbar. Uh, David Fleitas. Yeah, but Loyas had a piece of it. So from the other side here, Roman with the service near post. Juan Cayo defends it well. There's the shot in by Martinez. Kept out, and they continue to put the pressure on the Juan Cayo defense. Replaced Cristiano Campos in the 83rd minute in that first leg in Juan Cayo. His left-footed service to the penalty spot. Martinez! Golazo! Matias Martinez finally gets his goal. 2-1 Nacional, and we are all level on the aggregate at three. As it often happens with a team that could not find their footing in the second half, such as Nacional, all it takes is one, a team that needs two goals. The first one came, and then a flurry of opportunities, and Juan Cayo's defense oh. <laughs> absolutely discombobulated. Play after play, giving out chances, lots of time to place the pass for Martinez. Very well held by Fleitas. He sees Martinez, although he's right-footed, shaping off to impact it. As it came, And now, Roman chases it down. This is a deep service in. Headed down. It's going to fall for Alfaro. Alfaro. Twisting and turning, trying to shake off Perez. Gets it inside. The chance goes wide. Nacional certainly trying to get a goal. Couple of step over moves. There's Caballero. Caballero service inside. Looking for Aguilar. It's going to fall. The chance to shot. Goal! In second half stoppage time with the goal that will send them through to the second stage, second phase. Igniting, exciting, and delighting the supporters of El Tricolor. And it's a pattern we've been talking about, George, of difficulties to clear for Juan Cayo. Look at the time they had to look at that ball from the sky down. And then once it bounces, it's, it's typically a defense ball. There's two men going for that one. And very similar fashion from the second goal. A forward holds and makes room for a player coming with complete view of the situation. Nobody there to mark. And a pretty easy finish. It also contributed with that cross. With that cross, yep. And that's it. Nacional win at home 3-1. Move on to the second phase of the Copa Conmebol Libertadores. A historic second leg performance by El Tricolor.